I'm back with another episode of A Year on the Ladder. And today I'm meeting actor Bex to find out how she's got on in her shared ownership home in Latimer's Junction West in Southall. Bex, thank you so much for having me round today. You're your home is beautiful. I'm loving your style and I cannot wait thank to have you. a little look around later. Uh, but you've been here for a year now. So how has your first year as a homeowner been? A lot, a lot, <laughs> but really, really enjoyable. Like I still walk in here and I'm as grateful for it as the day that I bought it. You bought through shared ownership. Yeah. So how has that worked for you? And do you feel like it's given you that kind of like little bit of extra security and enjoyment and a bit of freedom? Oh, definitely. Like it's a really, really good balance between, you know, I, I wasn't in a position to be able to buy fully, um, you know, with, with my income things that just wasn't possible. And I honestly never thought that I would be able to get onto the ladder at all. Um, so having the shared ownership is a really good balance of, it's mine, it's partly mine, but it's mine. You know, I've got a buy in it and it's, you know, that's something that I never thought I'd be able to do. Um, definitely makes me feel like, you know, it's not going anywhere, no one's gonna kick me out. You know, renting is so, stressful in its own way it's, it's works and it's easy and it's it's you know what I had to do for a really really long time and obviously there is a renting part of this as well um but just having that you know the fact that a little bit of it is mine is it's so reassuring it's so I feel so lucky I feel so grateful for it um and yeah, just, I didn't expect to be able to do it. Yeah, because that's one thing that when I was walking around outside, you were literally like a two minute walk yeah. to the station yeah. for the Elizabeth right. line. Yeah. How has that helped you like get into work? Because sometimes you're working in the city. Yeah, so I, I work in Central um, as well as doing my acting work. And like door to door is less than half an hour. I think the, the Lizzie line from Southall to Tottenham Court Road is 17 minutes or something like that. Um, which when you consider like, we actually are quite far out, you know, we're near Heathrow. Yeah, yeah, um, but without the Elizabeth line, I love that you called it the Lizzie line, by the way. Lizzie That's the Lizzie I can't line. help myself. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> but without that before, it would have taken over an hour yeah. to get into Central from here. Yeah, definitely, it would have done. And what about energy? Because obviously you're living in a brand new apartment. You were the first person to be living here. Mm. How does that compare to where you were living before? Oh, it's so much better. <laughs> it's so much better. It's, you know, obviously, living alone rather than sharing there are going to be increases in certain things but in terms of like this building you mentioned double glazing double glazing is something that i wanted for like yes. 10 years i've been after double glazing for so long and it makes such a difference like my i think my my water prices are lower than in my old flat my energy i don't, obviously don't pay gas here because it's completely yep. electric um so there are lots of things that are just even, even if you might be paying slightly more overall, it works out so much better, it's so much more efficient. Uh, what percentage share did you take here? 25. 25. Yeah. Nice, okay. And that's, again, with, like you said before, being an actor, you didn't think you'd be getting onto the property market. Never at all. And, you know, I thought if I was able to maybe one day buy somewhere, it would be, you know, a tiny little flat, probably in a town outside of London, and I'd have to be commuting in and that, that kind of thing. So, you know, to have, in 25% starting there somewhere that, you know, zone four London with direct access into Central is it's more than I could have ever hoped for. And then finally, what about the kind of community aspect? Because we mentioned that you'd come from shared uh, rented accommodation, yeah. which is quite sociable. You're living with your yeah. friends and you moved to here without knowing anyone. Yeah, yeah. So to move by myself to an area of London that I'd never been to before. I haven't lived west for 10 years. Um, was, I was a bit like, oh God, like, I'm not gonna know anyone. No one's gonna know my part of town. Um, but I think because this, obviously it's a block of shared ownership. Um, everyone who lives in this block is, we're all in the same position. We've all, we've all moved in within the last like year and a half. Um, and so like, I've really got to know my neighbors, which has been really, really lovely. So you mentioned the terrace, which is beautiful because you're on the 11th floor and you've got some amazing views. So can you give me a little tour around if you wouldn't mind? Yeah, of course. Thanks. So we've got the kitchen yes. area. I was just saying about all your rose gold. Yeah, I do love a bit of rose gold. Rose gold and wood, you know, nice little aesthetic. Yeah. 
I'm mm. loving it in the corner as well where you've got your spices. Yeah. Brilliant. And it's beautiful open plan living, which I yeah. really like. So that's really nice. Do you have friends around a lot? Yeah, yeah, it's really nice. And I think this is my favorite corner. <laughs> <laughs> this me is a bit too. of me. Yes. It's so cute. I love yes. this. Now take me up to the balcony. Yes, of course. I'm so excited about this. <laughs> I'm just gonna make myself at home here. Oh, please it's do. So nice. It's nice. It's really it? nice and sheltered out here as well, isn't it? Yeah. Do you spend a lot of time out here? I do, yeah. So you spent New Year out here, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, so we've got a, a ninth floor roof terrace just down there. So did you get to see loads of different fireworks? Everywhere, like that's like incredible. panoramic view of oh. fireworks everywhere. And it lasted, you know, a good couple of hours. I love this little area in your hallway. Just a little area to chill. It's got a little bit shoes in there. It's got your What? It's storage as well. Shoes in there. You keep them all tucked out the way. Gems in there. Yeah. I love it. Uh, so this is bedroom. Oh, nice. So you've got built in storage mm. in built -in here, wardrobes, yeah. which is perfect. They're, they're great. really good size. Oh, they're so well. good. Yeah. yeah. Amazing. And you've got an extra space that yeah. I guess actually you've got it set up as like a makeup table, yeah. which is exactly what I would do. Yeah. <laughs> Lex, thank you so much for showing me around today. I'm so pleased that you're enjoying your shared oh, ownership home. You. And you're a homeowner. Yes, Yay! Oh my. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. I'll let you get on with your day. Thank you so um, much. I'll speak to you soon. See you soon.